What if time didn't move as we think? Imagine jumping ahead centuries or rewinding to change a key moment. In this video, we'll explore five mind-bending time travel theories that could make this science fiction dream a reality, or at least explain how time really works. First up is the wormhole theory, often called Einstein-Rosen bridges. Imagine space-time as a piece of paper. Fold it in half and poke a hole through it. This is what a wormhole might look like. It's a shortcut connecting two distant points in the universe, or maybe even two different times. Wormholes are purely theoretical. To keep them stable, we need exotic matter with negative energy, something we've never observed. Still, it's one of the most popular ideas in science fiction for a reason. For example, a spaceship is at one end of the galaxy, and another ship is at the other end, billions of light years away. Now, imagine they could travel through a wormhole. Instead of spending centuries crossing space, the ship could be on the other side in mere seconds. Now let's talk about time dilation, a proven concept from Einstein's special relativity. Here's how it works. As you approach the speed of light, time slows down for you compared to someone who's stationary. For example, if you were on a spaceship traveling at 90% of the speed of light, while your twin remains on Earth, after a journey that takes just 5 years for you, you return to Earth to find that your twin has aged nearly 50 years. You've only aged 5 years, but for them, decades have passed. Time really does slow down when you're moving that fast. This isn't fiction. This could be your future reality. Next is gravitational time dilation, a phenomenon predicted by Einstein's general relativity. Time moves slower in stronger gravitational fields. Imagine being close to a massive black hole, time for you would pass so slowly that years on Earth would seem like minutes to you. For example, consider this. A spaceship orbits a black hole for what feels like a few hours, but from the perspective of someone on Earth, entire centuries pass. In fact, if you stayed close enough to the black hole for just a day, you could return to Earth to find it has aged a thousand years. This isn't just something for science fiction movies, it's a consequence of the extreme forces of gravity predicted by Einstein's theory. This was famously shown in the movie Interstellar, where the astronauts aged much slower than people on Earth after visiting a planet near a black hole. While we can't go near black holes, we've proven this effect with satellites orbiting Earth. Now let's dive into the grandfather paradox. This is a fascinating problem with traveling into the past. Suppose you go back in time and prevent your grandfather from meeting your grandmother. Would you even exist to travel back in the first place? Imagine this. You go back to ancient time and accidentally stop your great-great-grandfather from meeting your great-great-grandmother. You never exist, and without you, who would have gone back in time in the first place? It's a mind-bending paradox where you can't affect the past without erasing your own future. The Novikov Self-Consistency Principle says, you can travel back in time, but you can't change the past because everything you do is already part of the past. For example, Imagine traveling back to 1912 to stop the Titanic from sinking. You try to warn the crew about the iceberg. However, your warnings are misunderstood or ignored, and your actions somehow lead the ship to collide with the iceberg. In the end, your presence in the past doesn't change the event but instead becomes part of the story. So, there you have it. Five theories that could make time travel possible. From wormholes bending space to the mind-bending idea of the Novikov self-consistency principle, these concepts might just reshape our understanding of time itself. What do you think? Could any of these theories hold the key to time travel? If you enjoyed this journey through time, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next video.